Coño, ¿qué es lo que pasa aquí ahora? Rico, man. Who goes there? Let me guess. You forgot to pay the bill again. I told you I have to take Phoenix and Mrs. classes. You and your fucking acting classes are gonna get us thrown out into the street. No, it's gonna get you thrown out into the street. Hey, hey, you're not gonna throw out your only cousin, all right? Cousin or no cousin, you out, Rico. I don't think so. I'm staying right here, okay? So then pay the fucking bill. I will. Just wait, all right? I'll pay it as soon as my next check comes in. That's what you always say. The next check. The next check. It's a month already. So pay the fucking bill. I will. Okay, right. Fuck it, asshole. Hey! Hey, hey! Watch your mouth. I love you, cuz. <sighs> Yo, motherfucker. I'm gonna rip your fucking head off. Yo, motherfucker, rip your fucking head off. You hear you being so ready, you know? Thank you for coming. Joe Velez? Dude. Dude, how'd it go? Same as always, man. Thanks for coming in. That was wonderful. Next. Damn, dude, that doesn't sound too good, man. Yeah. Is it your new headshot? Yeah. Let me see. Sure, man. These were a little bit more expensive, though, because I got my resume printed on the back. How much? Fucking three fifty, man. Damn, that's like my rent money, bro. Tell me about it. Charlie. What? Come on, man. Your name is Carlos. What's this Charlie stuff? Dude, you know that Charlie and Carlos mean the same thing, so quit busting my balls about it. Yeah, but I didn't know you call yourself Charlie. It's... I got smart, man. Being that my last name sounds Italian, you know what I'm saying? Oh, whatever's clever. You know, I'm surprised you don't do the same thing, man. A lot of actors change their name. Not me, man. Well, hold on. Ricardo Gonzalez. That's my name. Right. How about Richard G. Serio? Serio? <laughs> what are you trying to do? Have my name sold for breakfast here? Come on. No, 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 man. Listen to me. Listen to me. How about this? Richard, Richard G. Pantaglia. Or something, <laughs> something like that, man. Pantaglia. Yeah. Be, I mean, you can pass for those dark-skinned Italian types. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You're out of your mind. All right, all right. All right. Thank you for coming. Can I have your Right here. <laughs> Think about it, man, all right? Well, I go and get this part. Cuando sí te gusta te ponen a pregona, somos la mafia latina, somos mala. Yo, man, how dare they say I don't look Latino, man? That's messed up, man. What are you laughing about? Nothing, bro. Nothing. What's that smile, Rico? Yo, nothing. Just What's, what are you laughing hey, hey, about? Look, look. That's wrong. Tomorrow is another day. More auditions next week. Don't worry about it. All right. What you gonna do now? I'm gonna go home, man, make some calls. I'm looking to get myself an agent. An agent? Yeah, an agent. Look, you get yourself an agent, you better hook me up too, all right? Por supuesto que sí, hermano. All right, papa. Okay, suave, papa. Te veo más tarde. Charlie. It's wrong, Rico. girl in, in 3C, huh? Excuse me? I'm sorry. I mean, I live in 2C most of my life. I, I, I never saw you before. Oh, I just moved in. Here, why don't you let me help you with this? <laughs> Excuse me. 
Excuse me, no, I, I can handle it, thank well, you. Let me be your one man welcoming wagon, huh? All right, thank you. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> hey, so, uh, where'd you come from before, like, originally? East New York. Get out of here. Mm -hmm. I got some friends from around that way. Oh, really? Yeah. Cool. So, how do you like this neighborhood so far? You know, I gotta get used to where everything is and stuff. You can put my bags down. Wow. Thank you very much. No problem. Appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Hey, look, um, I'm right downstairs. 3C, 2C, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. What's your name again? I'm sorry, Rico. Rico. Nice to meet you, Rico. Nice to meet you. And you're... Marisol. Marisol. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right, thank you. All right. Bye-bye. Take it easy, okay? All right, you too. Thanks. Marisol. Yo. Um, I'll see you around. All right. All right. Está bien, no. Cuídate, ¿ah? ¿eh? Ok, no, no, está bien. Sí, no, no te preocupes. Ok, chao. Pepe, can you work some overtime tonight? Carlos just called in sick. I've got two drivers out on vacation. Sure. Yeah? No one knows I need the extra cash. Great, thanks. Oh, guess who came by today? Who? Tito. Tito? Yeah, remember Tito? He used to work the night shift for us. Tito, what's yeah. he been up to? He's doing really good. He bought himself this really nice, black, shiny town car. Oh, really? His, his clients are all completely rich. He's making so much money. He is so happy. I got to go back to work. Bliss? Yeah, what's the address? OK. <laughs> What's up, man? Hello. Nice to see you, man. Oye, Felipe, ¿cómo estás? Vaya, ¿cómo estás? Oye, Pepe, ¿cómo estás, brother? How you doing, man? All right, man. Oh, you looking to buy another car, man? I'll sell you mine. <laughs> no. I'm trying to get into a town car, man. You too, huh? Everybody's doing that now. Yeah, I know, but I can't afford it. Even the used ones are expensive. Pepe, you know how long it took you to save up to get this piece of shit, right? Over a year. Don't call my car a piece of shit. Mira. What if I told you that I could get you the money for this car in, say, about two, three months tops? Jerry, your ideas usually don't work. You know what I'm saying? Trust me, man. This one will. I gotta go, man. I'll think about it. How's that? Think too long, man. This is a limited time offer. Okay, you got it, man. I'll talk to you later, right? Oh, hello, Suave, okay? All right. Hey, Pepito. I see you took care of the bill. Yeah, no thanks to you. So what you got there? Might as well sign it over to me right now. Hey, con calma with that, all right? You'll get your money. How much do I owe you? $145.63. <laughs> no problem. I'll give it to you tomorrow. $145. And 63 cents, Rico. All right, all right. Did you get the part? No. What? Did he hit no, right? I don't know why I bother asking anymore. Damn, people. I'm gonna have to get a job now. What's that? I said I gotta get a job. What miracle is this? No miracle. 
My last check came in. <laughs> no more extensions, huh? No. So what does this mean? Did you uh, quit that acting bullshit and get yourself a real job? I don't think so. All it means is that I won't be able to commit to it fully now, that's all. I'll still take class once a week and I'll do acting on weekends, all right? At least you'll still have a job, and you can help me here with the bills. You going somewhere? Yeah, I'm gonna go back out for some overtime. Good for you. Do you need that paper? Yeah. See you later. Yeah. I'll see you later. Copy that. Someone called for a cab? Hmm? A cab? Did someone called for a cab? Oh, yeah, yeah, over there. Good, you can help me pick out some uh, scrubbing stuff. Ah, no problem. That's my specialty. Oh, good. <laughs> I can't wait to finish this apartment already. So, when my mom passed away, right, my cousin Pepper, he became my guardian angel. You know, me and him, like, you know, we've been living together for quite a while now, so it could get tedious, you know what I mean? But, you know, we love each Didn't other. Didn't you want to get something here? Yeah, I, I did, but I, I changed my mind. Uh, you know, can, can I uh, take your bag for you? Wait a minute, wait a minute. This is the second time you want to take my bags. Are you a delivery boy or something? No, I'm not a delivery <laughs> boy or something. All right, I'm sorry. As a matter of fact, I'm an actor. I mean, that's what I do, that's what I love. I mean, I'm not working right now, but someday I will be. Really? Yeah. When did you decide to become an actor? Well, when I was eight years old, right? My, my mom, she took me to see this flick called mm -hmm. Scarface. You ever seen it? Yeah, the one with Al Pacino. 
You're good, very good. Stupid for me to think you didn't see that movie. <laughs> yeah, I saw it. Anyway, I mean, it really affected me. You know, I, I got in trouble in school, you know, and my mom, you know, drove me crazy, left and right here and there. You know, I was stupid. Can you imitate him for me? Scarface. Yeah. Right here in the middle of Jackson yeah, Heights. Come on, so what? Come on, let me see you act. Okay, all right. You see that phone right there? Yeah. All right, there's a scene, right, in this movie where Alejandro Sosa sent Antonio to New York to do this big thing, and he right. messed up, right? So he's got to talk to him. Uh, look, I'm not going to talk anymore. I'll just show it to you. You want, okay. you want me okay. to act? I'll act. You know? <laughs> okay. Ready? All right. You're on the phone, right? Alice, how you doing? Tony, what happened? Oh, we had some problems, you know? I heard. Yeah? A friend made a speech at the UN today, Tony. He wasn't supposed to give that speech. Oh, well, your boy Alberto, you know, he's a piece of shit. I told him to do something, he wouldn't listen to me, so I had to cancel the freaking contract. My friends and I are pissed off, Tony. Oh, that's okay. There's a lot of Albertos. You know what we're doing next month? There's not gonna be a next month, you dumb sock socket. Hey, hey, you take it easy when you talk to me, okay? I told you a long time ago, you stupid little monkey, not to screw me. Hey, hey, who do you think you're talking to, huh? Who do you think you're talking to now? A bad boy? Who do you think? Hey, boy, come on, come on. You wanna go to walk? Come on, come on, come on. I took you to walk. Come on, come on, come on. Alex! That was great. It's not there. That was my patina. You happy? And I woke up the neighbors. That was great. You are nuts, man. You're enough for asking me to do that. I'm going to get arrested <laughs> in a minute. Where to, man? The wallet. Oh, oh fuck. Anything else you can tell me about this guy? No. It happened too fast. Okay, do the best we can. The best you can? You know, you guys always say that. This is my sixth driver to get mugged this year. Listen, lady, you do your job, we'll do ours, okay? Have a good night. I don't even know why you bother calling them. What am I supposed to do? Just let this go like nothing happened, Pepe? This car service can help you? Okay, well, the end, Yeah, what's the address? Well, at least you didn't get shot. Mm -hmm. I hate this shit. Jerry? You remember that guy you told me about? Mm-hmm. I want you to hook me up with him. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure. I'm gonna hook you up. I already told him about you. Come on, let's go. It's right here. Aquí. This guy is gonna hook you up, man. I've been working a little bit over a year for this guy, and I'm telling you, man, the rewards are excellent. You remember Heidel? Yeah, he used to work the uh, night shift with us. That's right. He's the one who hooked me up with this guy. Heidel got rich off this guy. After he made what he wanted, he packed up and moved to his country to live like a king, bro. <laughs> Outside this country, don't take much to live like a king, right? Look, don't worry. Everything's gonna be cool, all right? You just keep your mouth shut and you listen to what he has to say, you're gonna have that time card sooner than you think. Mira, who knows about this guy? Nobody, okay? This is incognito. It's on the slide, all right? I'm only hooking you up because you're my man. Who is it? It's Jerry. Hey, Corlu, how are you, man? This is Pepe. What's up? No, no, he's okay, man. He's okay with you. What you got things about around here? All right, come on. Have a seat. Right here. What's up, Hector? This is Pepe. 
Gordo, that's a nice bass, man. Yeah. yeah. These guys are all right, man. They, they drink a lot of whatever, but they, they're, all, they're okay, man. Gentlemen. How's it going, Javier? That's what do we have here? This is Pepe, man. This is the guy I've been telling you about. He works with me at the cab stand. <laughs> so you want to work for me, huh? Yes, sir. I'm sure Jerry's giving you the 411 of what you have to do. Yeah. It's very simple. When we need you, we'll call you as, uh, as a passenger requesting for you. <laughs> Our favorite cabbie. <laughs> <laughs> And you'll deliver a package for us and uh, bring another package back. It's very simple. Do you think you can handle that? Yeah, it's a piece of cake. Good. 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 Marisol. Hey, Mr. Actor Extraordinaire, how you doing? Yeah, you're funny. <laughs> uh, I was wondering if you wanted to come see a play that I'm in. Um, I don't know. I've been kind of busy, so I don't know if I have time. Uh, well, I'm not asking you to sit on the dentist chair. It's, it's a play. <laughs> it's a good one. Right? Um. Okay. 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 All right. What are you reading? Uh, it's, um... Oh, Gabriel Garcia Marquez. I love his works. Is Senor... this Spanish? Yeah. Or English. You know, translations never do justice, right? Yeah, that's true. This is great. So let me see the flyer. Oh, well, I'm sorry. Here, here you go. Look. Right here. This is the directions. Everything you need to know is right there. Pretty self-explanatory, right? All right. Yeah, okay. I'll give you a ticket at the door, okay? Okay, I can't wait. Yeah, I can. Take care. You too. Ha, ha, ha. 
What are you doing, man? Guess what, Pepito? I got a job. Fucking miracle, man. Good eye. Are you gonna ask me what kind of job I got? Rico, who cares, man? As long as you get a decent paycheck, you can be cleaning up horse shit for all I care, man. Forget you, then. I said, what time is it? You check your own watch, stupid. Yeah, it's Pepe. Pepe. Need a favor, man. I'm on the phone. I'm on the phone. Uh huh. Yeah, let me get the address. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll find it. Nos vemos. Pepe. Pepe, I need you to drop me off for the basketball court, cool? I gotta go to work, man. I thought you didn't work today, man. Got one quick ride, unless you want to take it with me first. Cool, I'll be right out. What money? Fucking guy, man. Here. Thanks, Pepito. You're the best. Ven conmigo. No, solamente tú. Chill out. Buddy, hope you don't mind me searching, huh? Estoy aquí para Javier. Have a seat. I'm okay. Have a seat. No me traigas este tipo más aquí, compadre. No me lo traigas más. ¿Cómo que no me lo traigas si yo estoy jugando bien? ¿Cómo me doy? ¿Tú quieres? Place a bet. Un bet, padre. Sí. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. No, no está bien. Pero el chance está largo, bro. Give it a shot again. Señora. Señora. ¿Qué? ¿Qué? 
Can I get a chicken sandwich, please? No, I chicken sandwich. Sorry. Okay. Uh, sausage. That's good, right? No, I sausage. No sausage. Steak. Steak. Can I have a steak? Let me check with the chef. Angel. Angel. Sí. ¿Hay más viste o no? No, no hay más. No, no hay más viste. I guess the Cuban sandwich is out of the question, huh? Oh, don't, oh, don't tell me. No more pork. <laughs> Guapo, yo le pego un tiro a cualquiera aquí que se ponga como la mujer mía. ¿Cómo lo traiga, pa? Chacho. Bueno, pero es que tú te son primos. Pero no, la entrada no, esa que tiene. Dame dos, dame dos. Pero avance, que ese tipo te habla de eso con una cara de cojo. Pero cuando apuntamos, ya yo me paro. Bueno, voy. Bueno, vente, vente. Aquí, aquí terminamos de hablar, no termino de hablar. Coño, ¿algún empleo? ¿Algún empleo? No lo traigas este tipo más. Oye, no, pero ¿qué pasa? No, 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 Coño, se pa' otra, no, fucking hungry, man. Hungry, la luz. Gracias. Nos vemos. Give my regards to Javier. Here you go. <laughs> You're doing good, Pepe. Keep up the good work. <laughs> Holy cow! How much you got there? Close to six thousand. Six thousand? Ah, man, I never touched six thousand dollars. And you ain't gonna touch my six thousand dollars. I can see how one of those guys can get hooked on this thing you're doing. Well, what's his name? Javier? Listen, I'm not gonna be doing this much longer. As soon as I get my money for my car. I'm out of there. That's what they all say. I guess I don't have to pay for next month's rent. Damn! <laughs> Rico, great job. See you next week. Thanks. Rico? Yeah. Come in here, please, please come in here. Yes, nice. Thanks for coming. <laughs> oh, my pleasure. Have a seat, nice. please. Thank you. Thank oh my you. God, I'm... you look great. Thank I you. love the show. Oh boy, it's a great show. Thank you, Rico. Uh, sorry about that. Somebody's here looking for you. Can you bring him in, please. Rico Gonzalez. Yeah. Hi. Hi. I'm Dorothy Siegel. You don't know me. No. <laughs> well, Dorothy. Me, Marisol. Marisol hi, and Dorothy. Hi, nice, nice to, meet, to meet, you. meet you. You're very talented. I mean, I am really impressed. <laughs> I'm a casting director, and right now yeah. I'm working, yes, I'm working on a John Myers film. John Myers? Mm -hmm. Who's John Myers? He's only the hottest director in New York and LA. Really? Yeah. Oh, look him up. up yes. <laughs> At any rate, uh. he is casting his new project, uh. which calls for a young male Hispanic talent, much like yourself. <laughs> Yeah. Actually, I think you'd be perfect for the part. So Thank I would you. like you to audition, oh, if you're interested, of course. Interested? Come on, you kidding me? I'm there. That's what I'm doing okay, well, here. I want you to take one of my cards. Okay. And I want you to call me Monday morning at 9 a.m. I'll be there. I'll call you at And eight. I'll set up an appointment. No, on 9. <laughs> I'll be there at 9. Thanks a lot. I Thanks. It's it. nice to meet nice you. Nice meeting you, Dorothy. Bye. Take Bye. care. Bye-bye. Get out! <laughs> You're gonna be a movie star, you'll see. Uh, hey, you hungry? And you're gonna forget about me. Uh, come on, uh, please, no. <laughs> yes, hey, I'm starving. Come let's on. go let's celebrate, huh? All right. And my keys. Yeah. <laughs> no. Thank you. 
So you always wanted to be a teacher? Yeah. Yeah. I love kids and, you know, I really feel that the young people in our community really need somebody to look up to and believe in them, you know? So I thought a teacher would be a good thing to do. I wish I had a teacher like you when I was growing up. <laughs> so what do you do besides acting? Well, I just found myself a waiter's position. Oh, really? I'm waiting for my big break to get in. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey. According to this fortune, you don't have to wait much longer because you're going to get that part. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> well, according to this one, it says you have just found your dream man. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> Seriously, I, I gotta say, I mean, you, uh, you have great energy, and you're sweet, and supportive, and I wish I had someone like you around all the time. <laughs> well, I think you have a lot of the same qualities, too. Well, yeah. <laughs> so how much more money you need before you get that car already? I don't know. I figure a couple of more deliveries should set me straight. Are you really gonna stop working for Javier once you get that money? I mean, the money is good, man. You could get your own stretch limo. You could even get your own limousine company, bro. Hi, right, Jerry. I'm a simple man. All I need is that car so I can live my life in peace. Can't figure you out, man. Don't bother trying, Papa. Oh, what you mean? Look what I bought the other day, man. What the fuck are you doing <laughs> with that, Jerry? Wow, wow. Put that away, man. <gasps> Tuta loco. What? That's for protection, bro. You need one? I can get you I one. I don't need one, right? Oh, well, I think you should think two times about that because these places that have your senses, man, are not exactly Disney, you know what I'm saying? And what if you get mugged again, huh? What are you gonna do about that? You gonna let them take your hard-earned money? Fuck that, man. You know what? Once I get that car, I don't have to worry about none of that bullshit. Whatever you say. It's right, whatever I say. Hello? Yeah, hold on. Rico! What? Oh! Who is it? Sounds white. Sounds white? So stupid. Hello? Rico, hi, it's Dorothy. How are you? Dorothy, hi. How you doing? Fine. Listen, Rico, I'm setting you up for a final callback. Okay. You're gonna be meeting the producers and the director. John Myers. But listen, Rico, don't worry about a thing. You'll do just fine. Just Okay. No problem. All right. Listen, Tuesday at 1 o'clock, sharp. All right, bye-bye. Guess what? You got the part and we're rich. No, no, not exactly. I got a final call back. What's that? It means that they like me a lot. Rico, you've been going to these people about 100 times. You mean to tell me they haven't made up their fucking minds yet? Look, before it was between me and about a hundred other actors. Now it's only two, three, four other guys. Two, three, or four. Why don't you let me know when you get the part, all right? Hi. Uh, hello, hello. <laughs> I'm looking for Rico. Marisol. Hi. I'm right here. How, How you doing? doing? Okay. Good. Hey, Pepe. Marisol, Marisol, Pepe. How Marisol. are you? I've heard so many things about you. Yeah, I heard um, about you too. Pepe was just on his way out. I am? Yeah, you were, remember? Okay. All right, nice meeting you. The pleasure was all mine. Take care. See you later. We go. What? She has a sister. No, okay? 
about a friend. I said no. anything. No. <laughs> because it's so funny. Funny, huh? That's the way to put it. This is a really interesting apartment. Uh, it's home. So, so. So what do you want to do today? Oh, well, before we do anything, I want to give you a little surprise. Really? Yeah. OK, I like surprises. What is it? Close your eyes. Yes, you may. Oh, Rico. This is so beautiful. Mm-hmm. Oh, gorgeous. I made it myself. You made this? Mm-hmm. My ma taught me. Oh, gorgeous. Can you put it on for me? Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay. I love these colors. Gorgeous. Match your dress. <laughs> How does it look? <clears throat> Beautiful. Really? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Just like you. This is the kind of shit I'm talking about, man. I ain't taking this shit no more. You hear me, motherfucker? You hear me, piece of shit? Thank you, Louie. Um, would you send in the next actor on your way out? Thanks. Well, what did you think? Mm. Don't blame that one on me, okay? He's the producer's nephew. Uh -huh. yeah. You're gonna love the next one. Rico, hi. Hey. This is Stan Levy, the writer. Hey, how you doing? And the director, John Myers. It's an honor, man. Do you have any questions? No. Would you like to sit or stand? Standing's fine. Great, okay. I think we'll start with the shooting scene. Actually, you know, uh, Rico, I want to start with scene 55. You know, the scene where you, you feel betrayed. Is it good? Sure. How could you do this to me? Just a minute. I'm coming. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Hey. <laughs> Sorry. It's okay. Yeah. How you doing? That's very nice. I'm fine. You look gorgeous. Thank you. As always. Thank you. What time's the movie? Oh, uh, 9.30. 9.30? Oh, God. Minutes. All right, I better hurry up. I'll be right out. Okay. okay. Nice place here. Thank you. Definitely cleaner than mine. <laughs> <laughs> No comment. Uh-huh. So when do you hear about that audition? Oh, uh, any day now. You must be nervous, huh? Yeah. A little. I'm sure whatever happens, you'll make the best of it. What was that? I said, I'm sure whatever happens, you'll make the best of it. What do you mean by that? I mean, if you get the part, I'm sure you'll do a great job. And if you don't get the part, which I am sure you will, because you're so talented. Yeah? You'll bust it out and you get something even better. Mm. Right? That's what I love about you. You're so damn positive.
so much for the moment. So you're gonna forget me when you're rich and famous? You think I do something like that? Mm, I don't know. I don't think so. Well, I want to make sure you don't. I want you to have this. Well, I can't have that. Yes. I want you to, Rico. Come on. Okay. I want us to I'm each in. have something special for each other. Go for it. <laughs> Who's this cute little guy? Hmm. Is it cousin? Nephew? No. That's my son. Oh. That's my sweetie. You never told me you had a kid before. Well, I was gonna tell you. I mean, I just... I wanted it to be like a surprise, you know? I wanted you guys to meet face to face. Where is he? <laughs> He's not here. He's with my mom. He's uh, upstate at her house. Okay. Yeah. I just wanted, I wanted to get things set up here, you know. I wanted to get the apartment hooked up and everything before I brought him. So. And plus, it's good for him to get out of the city. It's like going away to camp, you know. Hmm. Hmm. You don't have a problem with me having a son, do you? Oh, come on. Uh-uh. Coño, Rico. Tú estás loco, ¿ves qué te hace? Yo, Rico, man. You lucky you ran when you had the chance, bro. You could have gotten stuck with that shit, man. Tú sabes lo que es eso? Listen to me, Rico. You did the right thing. You ran like any normal guy would have done. As a matter of fact, I'm proud of you. You're too nice, man, all the time. Sometimes you need to be a scumbag. ¿Estás oyendo, Rico? Rico, are you awake? Yo, man, that whole sentimental shit inside of you's got to go, bro. Shit. I'm out of there when those fucking chicks say those fucked up three words. What's that, man? I need money? Ya tú sabes. Come on, Rico. Let's get out of here, bro. Let's check out a movie or something. I'm not in the mood right now. Rico, you gotta get this girl off of your mind, bro. Let's go outside. Clean up your head a little bit. I'll see you later. All right, man. Well, you keep in touch. Hasta luego, babe. Cuídate, papa. Okay. So tell me. Carlos told me you quit work. When are you gonna go look for another job? Don't start with me right now, okay? Okay. But just remember, you owe me some money, and your half of the rent is due very soon. No, he's not here. Where is this guy? He's never home anymore. What can I tell you, you know? I hardly ever see him, and I live here with him. It's always with that acting shit of his, you know? Yeah. Well, I just wanted to say hi to him before I went to class. Can you just tell him I came around again? Yeah, no problem. All right, take care. You take care of yourself. Thanks. When are you going to stop with this already? I just need a little time, okay? That's all. Rico, you're gonna run into her sooner or later. Tonya, we live in the same fucking building. Look, I'll take care of it, all right? Oh, shit, it's her again, man. Don't, Please, don't just, touch just, me. You go answer the door. You're not a kid, man. I'm gonna watch me some TV. Ha, <laughs> ha, 
cut loose. Come on. Come on, Rico. We're gonna be late for class again. Hey, hey, hey. ¿Alguna vez se ha sentido fuera de sitio en una fiesta? ¿En su trabajo? ¿En su vecindario? En este país es importante y necesario hablar inglés. Por eso con Inglés to English le garantizamos que usted hablará inglés en cuatro semanas por solo $49.99. ¿Dónde es la parada de autobús? Where is the bus stop? Llame ahora 1-800-555-7742 y usted también puede ser la atracción de la fiesta. So I said, do you accept travel checks? <laughs> She said, no, we take bus bags. <laughs> Por eso, llame ahora y no deje que esto le pase a usted. Buenos días. Hello, can you help me out? ¿En qué le puedo ayudar? I don't speak any Spanish. Can you speak any English? Hello, hello, are you there? Hello. Pero mira lo que tiene en la mano. Iba a decir fuerte aplauso, pero no vale la pena. ¿eh? Okay, vamos entonces a traer a Dante. Gracias, Carlos, por habernos deleitado con tu maravilloso talento en el baloncesto. Vamos a ver si este otro le cabe el sombrero. Perdón, so perdón, Sandra, por favor, ay, Dios mío, ayúdame aquí. Ok, 30 segundos, caballero. Dele la primera bola. Well, can you answer that for me? Sure. Hello? Rico? Yeah, can you hold on for a second? Rico, teléfono. Yeah? Tati, hey, how you doing? Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I'm here. I, I just don't, I don't know what to say. That's all. I, I don't need the world. Okay. Yeah, I'll be there. Mm -hmm. What's going on? I got it. You got what? At the bar. Mira que hermano. No, 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 Party's out here. Yeah. Ain't in my room. Hey. Yo, hey. My main man right here. That's best. That's my main man. <laughs> Excuse me. Talk to my famous cousin for a minute. Thank you. What's up, Papa? How you doing, Papa? Listen, huh? I just wanted to say that I'm proud of you, man. I know I said some mean things before, but you gotta understand where I'm coming from, Rico. You know, life is rough, man. Sometimes things don't go the way you expect them to. You understand what I'm saying to you? <laughs> I, 
I understand that you're drunk. Fucking guy, it's not funny, man. I'm trying to talk to you here. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's all right. What I'm trying to say, man, is that you did good, man. Thank you. You did real good. And that. I love you. Oh, what are you doing? What do you, what do you do that for? What are you doing? Just kiss me. Come on, don't do that. There's people here with me. Hey, what? I can't kiss my cousin? Not for all that. Well, no, no doubt, no doubt. See what I'm saying? I, I made him with yesterday, you know what I'm saying? I taught him the skill. All that hey. shit, you know what I'm saying? How you doing? Officer, What's how you going doing? on up here? Oh, you didn't hear yet? That nigga Mico's a movie star. What? No, that nigga, you better go get your swerve already. Get out of here. Where is he? He's up in the crib and shit. I was saying. Yo, what's up? Yeah, yeah. How's it going? Yeah. 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 Congratulations, kid. Your father now. What? Come on, kid. You told me you dealing with that similar like the daycare center, you babysitting, kid. Nah, nah. But that nah. still got you carrying pampers now. Yo, yo, yo. I don't need that chin in my life for now, okay? <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be a father now, huh? Carrying pampers, man. Why are you so stupid sometimes, Jeff? Wait, 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 come here. Leave me alone, Rico, all right? Just leave me alone! Just leave me alone, Rico, I'm look, telling you, just look, go away! It was a stupid joke, all right? That's all it was, okay? Yes, it was a stupid joke! Look. How could you talk about my son like that? You don't even know him! Well, look, if you would've told me about your kid, all right? I, I wouldn't say shit like you. that, okay? I was gonna tell you about my son! You didn't even give me a fucking chance! Look, please. My son doesn't need you to be his father! You could never be my son's father, all right? I know what it's like to not have a father, okay? Yo, he doesn't need you to show Can I fucking talk to you, please? You wanna stop? Come on. Yeah, I understand completely. I don't actually agree with your decision, but if that's who you want, you got it. Send him in, Beth. Listen, I gotta run. I'll call you back later. Fine. Bye. Rico, hi. Hey. Have a seat. Uh, what do I sign? Rico, something came up. What? One of the producers just let me know that they'd... They've decided to go with someone else. I'm sorry, Rico. Listen, um, don't worry. If John Myers has anything else, you'll definitely be considered. I mean, who knows? Paul Marinelli may drop away from the role at the last minute, and then you'll definitely get your part back again. Paul Marinelli. TV show, Paul Marinelli, Paul Marinelli. Yeah, that's the one. He's big right now, and the show is really hot. I thought you guys were looking for this, like, young, unknown Latino actor. Paul Marinelli is not Latino. The studio decided to go with the star. I'm sorry. You're sorry. Yo, man, fucking Hollywood scumbags, Rico. I can't believe they did that shit to you. Shit, I knew it. You knew what? That that acting dream of his was not gonna come through. So what, he, he's supposed to quit after, after how many years, Rico? Eight years. Look at that, eight years. He's supposed to throw the towel now? Yeah, he should quit while he's ahead. Hey, I am no pendejo quitter like you, okay? Whatever. Yo, Rico, remember when we were kids? We were talking about going to California? <laughs> yeah. California? What, that place with all the earthquakes? And where everybody and their grandmother wants to be, what, actors? You shut up already? You think it's a good idea? I don't see why not. Got nothing to lose here. All I'm saying is that you should get yourself a full-time job and leave that acting shit to the side. Look, go make your phone call, all right? I got an idea, man. Pepe, he's just about ready to buy that limousine any day. He could give you his cacharrita. <laughs> what? 
El Charita, that little piece of shit he's driving around. Yeah, man, you come over, you work over at Bliss. I got the serious connection to make the big bucks, man. Okay? Yo, Jerry, I don't mean any disrespect to you, but Rico's not about driving a taxi. You know what I'm saying? Either way, if you decide to go to California, man, you go there more rich than the movie stars. Okay? Tell me. Thank you, Bimo. Thank you. Oh, yeah, I gotta go make a run. Wanna come? Yeah. See you guys later. Think about it. You're not thinking about it, are you? Come on, man. You're not thinking about that. You drive, man. I'm tired. Good, because you drive like a pussy. You are what you eat, pendejo. <laughs> So you seriously thinking about getting out once you get enough money for the car, huh? Yeah, I'm not greedy. What's that supposed to mean? Huh? You trying to say that I'm doing this because I'm greedy for money? I didn't say that, but you did. Let me tell you something. A lot of people don't do this because they're greedy for money. Oh, no? No, they do it because they have mouths to feed. Okay? They do it because they haven't had the opportunity to get an education that gets them the job that pays them fifty, sixty, seventy thousand dollars a year. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You got a job. You don't have a wife and ten kids. So what are you talking about? Okay, you're right. I don't have a wife and ten kids to feed. But you tengo mi mamá. Okay? And I have five brothers that I have to support back in my country. You never told me that. What, I'm supposed to tell you everything? What, are we boyfriend and girlfriend now? Huh? <laughs> Barry, when we drop this off at Javier's, let's go get something to eat, man. I'm fucking hungry. Okay. Where you want to go? I don't know. Let's try that new place at uh, the Cuchifrito place over on 82nd Street. A esta hora. Yeah, why not, man? Okay, that sounds good, man. Jerry, you're going through fucking red lights, Jerry. What are you, you doing? You want me to drive, right? You're going to inchar la bola ahora. Dejame quieto, man. There's nobody around. It's 3.30 in the morning. Take it easy. Relax. You fucking pendejo, man. I knew it. I knew this was going to happen. Fucking shit, I can't man. believe this shit. Oh, man. I'm going to put it here. Shh. Okay, don't do... I, I told you, all right? Leave this shit, shit. Oh shit. Here, put this in the glove compartment. Avanza, coño! Oh shit, what the fuck am I gonna do with this? Hide it, man. Doesn't fucking fit, man. And put it under the seat. Doesn't fit. Then put it under your legs, man. Fourteen meters, twenty-five on tech two. Oh shit, they come, man. Good evening, officer. How how are you this morning? License and registration. Fantastic. Jerry Sanchez. Who's the car belong to, Jerry? It belongs to me, officer. Excuse me. He wasn't talking to you. Who's it belong to? To him? Let me have your license. P.P. Gonzalez. It's Pepe Gonzalez. That's what I said. You two been drinking tonight? No, no, we're religious. <laughs> religious. What's so damn important that you have to run a red light? We were on our way home. I, I didn't realize that we went through a red light. You still live at 3652 86th Street, Jerry? Yeah. You realize that's the other way. Actually, first we were going to visit with his grandmother, and then we were going to go home. Step out of it. Why? Two. Out of the car. Step to the rear of the vehicle. 
hands on the hood. What did we do? Shut up. Do you have any weapons or sharp implements I should know about? No, no, no sir. Huh? Hey, what's this? What's in the package? You guys want to answer him? I don't know. Well, is it yours? No, sir. Then whose is it? Customer call for a delivery. That's what I'm doing, a delivery. I'm just doing my job, officer. Yeah, <laughs> you're just doing your job. So you don't know what's in this package? You have no idea. No. I don't know nothing about the package. Put your hands behind your head. Put your hands behind your head. Get your ass over here. All right, gentlemen, this is what we're going to do. Right. You're going to lay right here, right down on the floor, face yeah. down, hands behind your head. Now, you're going to stay like that for five minutes. If you move, even if you breathe, if you fart, we'll be back here to arrest you. Comprende? Yeah. yeah. It's over, man. It's fucking over, man. Fuck, fuck, man. Fuck. He's never gonna believe us. I'm telling you right now, not in a million fucking years, man. He's gonna think that we stole it from him, man. You don't have to come, all right? Or he doesn't have to know that you were there with me. Shit, Pepe, it doesn't matter, man. It doesn't fucking matter. I was the one that brought you over to him, okay? If he doesn't believe you, he's gonna think that I stole from him, too. He has to believe shit, us, all right? Shit, he has man. to believe us. Fucking shit, Pepe. It, you don't understand, man. He's gonna think that we stole from him. He's gonna kill us no matter what, okay? He's gonna kill us just for having fucked up. Fucked up. Get up, yeah, man. man. Let me think, Gary. Oh, Let me think. Oh, Let me fucking think. Pepe, you crazy? I'll talk to him man to man. It'll be okay. You don't know this guy, Pepe. Do what I'm doing, get the hell out of town, man. By the time he comes to look for us, we could be hundreds of miles away from him. We have enough money saved up to do it. Pepe, you think on me, mama, bro. It'll be all right, man. Trust me, man. Fucking crazy to be doing this, you know that, right? You take care of yourself, all right? goes to Paco. Hey, Pepe. Hey, how's it going? Well, have a seat. Where's my package? 
Ran into a little problem. Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you mean, a little problem? What's that? Tell me. Pulled over by some cops. What? What do you mean you got pulled over by some cops? <sighs> what the fuck did you do to make them pull you over? And where the fuck is my package? Ran through a red light. Then they found the package. And they took it. In other words, you fucked up. Well, tell me, what were their uh, badge numbers? I didn't see any badge numbers. What was their car number? I really happened too fast, man. I didn't see any car numbers. Wait, 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 wait. You must think I'm fucking stupid, right? <laughs> 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 Sorry, I stole me, motherfucker. Huh? Where the fuck is my? Tell you the truth, huh? that motherfucker. Where the fuck is my money, huh? For the last time. Where's my money? Okay. Está bien. I'll take you to it. Now we're talking. Go with this piece of shit. Bring my shit back with me, too. Because this is not over. So we got problems, okay? And Marisol? I can't just leave it like that, all right? Marisol? Yeah, Marisol. You can't fucking take care of yourself and you're gonna take care of a woman and her kids? Yo, man, fuck you with Yo, that fuck shit. you, man. Yo, fuck, get the fuck off of me. I ain't going fuck this no way, all right? Man. We leave now. And then if you want, you come back and you take care of them when you got something to offer them. I got something to offer them, Pepe. You don't understand that, man. We ain't got shit. I ain't got shit. We ain't got shit, Rico. Two minutes, Papa.
Nico, you drive. What are you doing? I'm not going. You know you can't go back there. I know. You gonna be all right? No, 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 no. Let me go. Just take it. This is the last time I promise you. 